Kelevanoa. They're in the tunnel, ready to come out. Ayose for Masi, who is wearing number two in the Fiji side, was uh, the best player of the Maris Sevens last year. He scored a hat trick of tries to help Tamba Tamu win over police last year. This year, he's in the Fiji side and he will be uh, picking against the Tamba Tamu. Ayose for Masi plays for the Eastern Saints Rugby Club in the Suva competition. They won the Koroturanga Championship. The match officials uh, following the two teams. Jerry Tuai, Meli Deranalangi, Simeone Dede, Ayose for Masi, Chuta Wainingolo. In the forward for VG will be Ayose for Masi, Kalione Nasoko and Meli Deranalangi. Jerry Tuai and Kitione Talinga will be at halves. Nadungu has been dropped to the bench. And then Sireli Mangala is 10-7 in the cup semi-final. We're set for the $20,000 final at the 45th Fiji Bida Maris Sevens. $15,000 for the winner. $5,000 for the runner-up. Will it be Tambandamu to retain their title? Or will Fiji Barbarians put their name on the trophy list after 12 years? The last time the Fiji Barbarians won it in 2009. Referee for this game is Tailevu Men Tevita Rokovereni. There goes the firecrackers even before the final. All set for a big Sapphire anniversary Fiji Beta Maris Sevens final. Kalione Nasoko. Ketione Talinga. 27-year-old from Dotambo Village kicks the Fiji Bida Sevens final alive. And uh, Fiji quickly up there. It's on the Tambandamu side. They're deep inside their own territory. Ten minutes each way, the final. First penalty to Fiji, quickly taken by Kalione Nasoko. Nasoko takes it up, taken in a good tackle by Kamineli Rasaku. It's there for Fiji, Yosefo Masi gets it away. Here's chance, numbers, oh, not needed. Jerry Tuai, the step, and then the acceleration, perfect. He puts Fiji up five points to nil. Well, he celebrated his 32nd birthday last Tuesday. Will he celebrate today? Kalione Nasoko. That was good work. Iosefo Masi, the delivery. Look at Jerry Tuai. Step and over. Easy. World Rugby Sevens best player over the 2019 2020 season. And uh, the conversion is good from right in front from Talinga. And uh, that is uh, 7 0. Jerry Tuai, wonderful shot from the camera at the back. So we wait in the middle. Kitione Talinga. High one uh, taken well on that side by Kavakini Tambu. Kalevanua, no, it was Vakauni Valu and uh, it's there for Kelevanua, the captain. Flicks it away. Here's Netani Nandavo. Bumps off one. Netani Nandavo. Stocky winger of Tambandamu. Sets it up well. Kelevanua clears it off. Kamenieli Rasaku. Rasaku takes it up and he sets it up there for Tambandamu. Away quickly that time from Tomas Imbulai. And then taking it up. That's Kelevanua. So it's there. Held. Not releasing in the tackle. Ketione Talinga. Talinga fires it out. Good job by Talinga. His conversion after the full-time buzzer in the semi-final put Fiji in the final. 
7 0. We're playing 10 minutes each way in the final. Under lights here at the ANZ Stadium. Good work that time by Yosef Omasi as Fiji get it away very quickly. Now, oh, that's a slicing run and uh, running to the corner. That's a try for Sireli Mangala. The 21 year old from Nakorotumbu in Ra. Former RKS boy. Very good work by Fiji. And Sireli Mangala, look at him go. From set piece move. Ketione Talinga looking for the extra points from wide out. Not able to find that. Sireli Mangala got away and he knew that he had the speed to go in the corner. Beautiful. Madamu shell shot. High kick from Kitione Talinga. Now it's a oh, good tackle by Meli Dernalangi and Fiji go on the counter. They've got it. Eose for Masi. Good work. Talinga. Flex it away. Here's Chuta Wainingolo. Oh, Fiji making it look so simple. Three tries now. Chuta gets that in the corner. That's 17 points to nil. As close encounters earlier in the semi finals, but looks like Tambandamu is not able to keep up with this fired up Fiji side. Fiji leads 17 nil. So Kitione Talinga. Wonderful shot. Oh, that's a great one. And the flakes go up. 19 points to nil. Chuta, winding goal. Try in the corner. Long high kick there is. Oh, dropped by Netani Nandavo. It's picked up by Chuta Wainingolo. He looks to go to the corner again. Wainingolo, good uh, tackle around the legs that time. Ball comes back. It's there for Jerry Tuwai. The little dance, and then he finds Meli Deranalangi. Deranalangi's away. Deranalangi gets tackled. He's looking for support. Fiji's have it secured. There for Jerry Tuwai. Tuwai will have to dig in. Waits for it. Now he's got it. Flicks it away on towards the left. Talinga got it away. Kalion and Nasoko are no look pass for his captain Jerry Tuwai. Jerry goes in the corner, the step, and Jerry Tuwai. Second try for Tuwai. The magician showing his tricks over here. 24 points to nil. Sireli Mangala. He got caught, found Kalyone Nasoko. Look at that, no look pass from the former captain to the captain today. And Jerry Tuwai stepping away from the last defender into the corner. That's one way traffic. Jerry Tuwai, second try in the first half. Four tries for Fiji, 24 nil. This man has converted two already. Looking for his third. No, he's missed it. Jerry Tuwai. Wonderful finish in the corner. They've already got one hand on the 45th Fiji Bitter Mary Sevens title. Still seven and a half minutes only gone in this one. Long way to go. Netani Nandavo. Kalevanoa there doing well. It's uh, there for Dakao Nivalu out from Tomasi Mbulai and then trying to straighten it up is Kavikini Tambu. He loses, loses the ball in contact. Fiji can't clean that up. Chuta Wainingolo. They'll come back. 
for the knock-on from Kavakini Tambu and Fiji will feed the scrum. Near 10 meters mark in Tambandamu territory, eight minutes gone. Kavakini Tambu, impressive this weekend, but this time he tried to uh, get the pass away, didn't work for him. Nukuilau native from Navosa, Tambu, younger brother of Sevuloni Modenadangi, Jerry Tuwai, Newtown would be proud of him, hails from Vakon Rovidal, there it's out on the other side, that's Kirione Talinga, Talinga, tries to get away from Kelevanua, good work, Talinga, the Tambu man from Nandi, Olympic gold medalist with Fiji in 2016. He started the final, putting Weiss Nadungu on the bench. Weiss will surely have his turn later. This is a long final. And uh, Fiji go with the kick and uh, gain territory. Talinga made his debut for Fiji in 2015 in Dubai. Here's Jerry Tuwai. He made his debut 2014 in Gold Coast, Australia. What a beautiful place that is. For sevens rugby. Now, over the top. Good work that time uh, from Josef Omasi. Best player last year in the Maris Sevens. How it comes? Oh, it's lost. It was a high one. Sireli Mangala needed to get up there to take it. The 21-year-old... Uh, Nakoro Tumbu men from Ra. That's from Kitione Talinga. Bit of a high pass. So just sweat on those palms probably. Near 22 meters mark. Dying seconds in the first half. It's Tambandamu with possession. Dakao Nivalu. And uh, the penalty comes in the scrum against the Fiji. Tambandamu will have it. Last play for Tambandamu in the first half. They're about 74, now 78 meters away from the try line the other side. What will they do? Oh, they get uh, bundled there. Rasaku then picked up by Tambu. Tambu tries to get away. Good tackle by Darren Alangi. It's set up there for Kelevanua. He flicks that away. Here they come now. Johnny Vota. Johnny Vota takes it through former Fiji Sevens player. He sets it up there, out quickly that time from Kelevanua, the captain. Dakao Nivalu gets it away, Tambu, good work that time, Rasaku, now the stocky winger, Netani Nandavo. Oh, he's taken in a good tackle that time uh, by, uh, who that was, Chutawan Ingolo. And then it's uh, played up that time by Tambandamu, who have it. Goes to the ground, that's 10 meters mark in the Fiji territory. Ball comes out. On from Dakao Nivalu to Kelevanua, on to Tomasi Bulai. Bulai does well. He uh, turns away, looks for support. Still Bulai gets it in field, and now it's Kelevanua. Good work by Tambandamu. Tambandamu look for support onto Dakao Nivalu, and Dakao Nivalu will go straight through and in between the sticks. Tambandamu. It's taken them more than 10 minutes to put the first points on the board, but they've got there. It's 24 points to five now. Good work. They kept the ball alive. They had support players right through. And Fiji could only chase them and uh, try for Dan Dakaunivalu. Kelevanua from right in front. And he puts that over. 24 7. Shoot the winding golo. Tambandamu. One reply in the form of. Denny Vakaunivalu, Kavakini Tambu, popped up, ready for the second half. Petro Kelevanua will start the second half. A high kick it is, it hangs in there, and uh, Fiji get up and uh, they palm it back. Quickly uh, getting that out, and uh, Sireli Mangala puts it to the boot, and uh, driven downfield. Uh, that was Chuta Waningolo, I think. So, that was Sireli, and... Uh, we uh, wait. Oh, Sirelli has got a bloody mouth. So, uh, he has to go to the blood bin. No, they'll check him in. No, Weiss Nadungu goes in. So, he has to go off the field of play. And uh, Weiss Nadungu goes on for Fiji. So, Talinga at playmaker. Nadungu at Rova. 
quick work. Benjamino Vota, Antuga, Kalevanua. Down to the ground there for uh, Kavakini Tambo. Johnny Vota, he's worked hard over the two days at the Mary Sevens. Fiji at the counter ruck, diving through the time. And the penalty will come for Fiji. Josua Vakuru Nambili is in, the 26 year old. Kavakini Tambo, part of the Fiji Seven squad. Nukui Lao Men from Navosa. Coach Gareth Faber would be happy with the scoreboard so far after the edge of the seat thriller in the semi-final against Rewasa. So here, picked up by Weiss Nadungu. Nadungu puts the kick through and uh, referee says play on, no problem there. And Tambandamu will get it at the back, Netani Nandavo. Nandavo. Oh, couldn't take that uh, cleanly and that's knocked on by Kamenieli Rasaku, another Fiji 7 squad member, the young boy. Nandavo took the tackle and looked for Rasaku, went to his boot places, couldn't pick that up properly. Rasaku, maybe a scrum. So, just holding on, Benjamino Vota is going on. So, Benjamino Vota will join the front row. Kavakini Tambu clarifying something with referee Rocco Vereni. Tambu in the middle, Vota on the far side, and uh, Vota on this side. Far side is Johnny, this side is Benjamino. Jerry Tuwai to feed it in. To Wai. That's 22 meters mark in the opposition territory. Fiji, good work. Wais Nadungu, Wining Golo. Wining Golo turns, goes straight at the Tambandamu defense. Good power play by Chuta Wining Golo. He sits it up there and then it's cleared by Fiji. Good work by Talinga. And Jerry Tuwai goes with a kick pass and this is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Simeone Vede, the Namosi man, 35 years old goes in to score the try former Tambandamu player himself he's got a big smile look at Jerry Tuai that's master play that is classic that's one for the highlights reel Jerry Tuai with the kick pass Simeone Dede going in to score for Fiji and they stretch their lead now 29-7 first try of the second half Weiss Nadungu will look for the extra points from the boot Fiji, look on track. 31-7. Five tries. Jerry Tuai. Master act. Simeone Dede. No mistake. Perfect. Now here's uh, Levi Ikanikonda who's gone on the park. From a super grammar boy. From Rewa. As Netani Nandavo is Tambandamu going backwards. And the flag is up from this side from Mr. Vosalevu. And that will be uh, Fiji with the throw. Line out throw. Netani Nandavo. No, fall, fall. <laughs> Out already before the piece of play that they just saw. Now, Nikani <laughs> Nandavo has come off the field of play. Here's Jerry Tuwai. Good work by Levi Ekani Konda. Into the middle is Weiss Nadungu. Nadungu holds it and turns it, changing direction. In for Jerry Tuwai. Little step. Jerry Tuwai with the kick and chase. Jerry Tuwai chasing for it. It's there at the back, uh, Tambandamu. They've got it. The penalty comes for Fiji. Jerry Tuai was uh, over the top of that. This man, 32 years young, playing very well. Jerry Tuai takes a little bit of time to get up. Is he saying, yes, he's saying he's had enough. He wants to change. Now they'll carry on. And uh, Nadungu gets it. Into the middle it goes. Taken up well that time by Vakuru Nambili. And then it's flicked out and comes very close to the corner. Here's the tank. Tuivuaka. Over the top they go. Ikani Konda gets it out. 
Jerry Tuai once again stepping. Oh, it gave it away to Kamineli Rasaku. It was lost forward by Jerry Tuai. It's with Tambandamu now. They've got four minutes to try and score four tries and win this. Time is running away from Tambandamu. We'll have a new champion, it seems like, in the Maris Sevens. The Safaya Anniversary, 45th, Fiji Beda, Maris Sevens, Petro Kelevanua, the captain of Tambandamu. Five times champions in the last six years. In the final again in the seventh year. But they've got hard work in front of them. Now about three minutes left to play. They need four tries. If they are to take this championship. It's flicked away the time and uh, lost forward. Referee says advantage to Fiji. It's picked at the back there by Jerry Tuai. Gets it out into Asaili Tuivuaka. Tuivuaka. Whoa. <laughs> Benjamino Vota. Copped a big one. And then Kavekini Tambu said, Come here, mate. Navosa versus Namosi. Navosa won that battle. That's the tickle of the Highlanders. First, Benjamino Vota. And now Tuivuaka went over the top. And uh, that's Daniele Zakaunivalu. And uh, coming through was uh, Tambu with a shoulder. Someone is down injured. That's Benjamino Vota. He got hit by Tuivuaka. I think uh, he's had enough. No, he will go on. He'll carry on. He's okay. Tuivuaka. Shoulder charge, says the referee. And Fiji have the penalty. Levi Ikanikonda putting it to the boot and firing it downfield on the Grinstein touch. As uh, we now wait. For Jerry Tuai, still on the park. He'll throw this in. Tuai over the top. Vakuru Nambili. Good work that time by Tuai. Into Weiss Nadungu. Changes direction. Finds Tuivuaka. Here's a replay of the last time, probably. And Tambu gets him. And uh, they've managed to rip the ball away from him. But there's the tussle on the ground that time. And uh, it's uh, spilled by Vakuru Nambili. Joshua Vakuru Nambili. It's there for... Uh, well, Joshua Vakuru, Vakuru Nambili has his own billboard in his village in Baravi. He's a star. Gareth Baber barking the orders from the side. And uh, here's Tambandamu Petro Kalevanua. Tambandamu playing for pride, looking for probably a consolation try to finish this off. It won't mean anything on the score card. Fiji will be crowned new champions of the 45th Fiji Beda Marist Sevens. There's the full time buzzer, Petro Kalevanua gets it back trying to uh, go forward there that time is Glenn Zakautini who's on the park for uh, Tambandamu and here's Kavikini Tambu they're still going Tambu sets that up Benjamino Vota gets in there to clear it away Kelevanua out quickly show of the ball and uh, away goes Semisi Tasere infield pass is good and Captain Petro Kalevanua will finish off the Fiji Bida Mary Sevens with a try for the defending champions as they hand the rein now to the new champions, Fiji Shadow Team. A good break by Semisi Tasere. And then Kalevanua 
wonderful dive to finish this off. 31-12, a kick to come from right in front. Petro Kalevanoa waits for Semisi Tasere, who puts it over. And the full-time score will read 31 Fiji, 14 for Tambandamu. Semisi Tasere, infield pass to his captain. The inside run on the channel. And Kalevanoa, the dive finish. Here's Jerry Tuai and Kamenieli Rasaku. Great sportsmanship, Jerry Tuai knows Kamenieli Rasaku will grow in the game. Probably one day he will wear that number nine Fiji jersey. They all know each other very well, Levi Ikani Konda. Uh, it's uh, Simeone there, the, the former Tambandamu player there with the Tambandamu team. Josef Omasi is a former Tambandamu player. Josefa Taladolo is also a former Tambandamu player. Uh, Tuai and Vakur Nambili there. Josef Omasi wearing two former Tambandamu player. Last year he played for Tambandamu and helped them win the Maris Sevens. Full time in the 45th Fiji Bida Maris Sevens final. Fiji Shadow Sevens 31. CK Easy by Tambandamu 14. New champion in the Maris Sevens. As the two teams huddle. So let's go to the sideline. And uh, we've got Gareth Baber with Aquila Dama. Okay, yes, uh, Cindy, I'm here with uh, the national coach, Gareth Baber. Coach, your thoughts on uh, the final tonight? Probably saved our best to last. Uh, we haven't had it all our own way, and that's courtesy of the competition that's been against us. Every team has played as if it's a cup final. That's exactly what we need. We know going to an Olympics, we've talked about playing six cup finals, and coming out here this weekend, it was tough. We scraped by in a couple of them, and that's what we're going to need is le those learnings from that to be able to push into the Olympics. And it's a fantastic, as is always with marriage, a fantastic tournament. You were tested three times, by fire and twice by Rewasa Taibuni. Did that hit some nerves as well? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I'm a human being and you know, I want to win in everything that I do. And, you know, I, we, we work so hard to put performances together with individuals to get them collectively as a team and then put them under pressure. And they were put under pressure and, and they came through. I know there's people out there that think one or two of those games shouldn't have gone our way. And that's rugby, that's sport. But we found a way through and we did that. And then what happens is what you just saw there where Dabba Dama were a fantastic side and, and we saved our best and, and got above them, and which was really positive for us moving forward. Finally, what stood out for you and uh, were there some players that uh, you saw for the first time uh, in action here at the Mari Sevens? Well, what stood out for me was, was the level of intensity and the physicality which I always see. I was pleased that there was a there was you know, much better you know, control from the players throughout the whole tournament. Um, I'll say it again, there's a player that really incite, excites me is Sorelli Mangali. Uh, playing for us, he's in the squad, he's only a young man and you know he took the final there by storm. That's Jerry Tuai. You see him back doing what he's doing, he's teasing people, but it's the way he is with the group. And you know, that Fiji team is in his image, and it's fantastic to have an individual like that with the right values, right behaviors, guiding these young men to, to where they need to get to. Sorry, if there's a World Series leg next week, would you take the same team? Yeah, potentially, yeah. I mean, I can't say for certain now, there's got a couple of injuries, but that's what I picked the team to, and that's how we did it as a coaching staff. We were going to a series event now, what would we pick? And that was the 15 that were here. Obviously, you only pick up 13 when you go overseas, but um, yeah, it would have been those boys. That's the that's the nature of the, the sort of competition we're in within the squad, and there's some good players playing elsewhere. You know, Nandu was playing for Army, you've got Cavakini, you've got uh, um, a couple of others playing for other teams as well, and, and that's important to keep them playing playing, keep them at that competition level, and this competition does just that. Thanks, Coach. So great work by Fiji Shadow Sevens. Is there... They're in the huddle, both teams. Tambandamu 